Yeah, you too. It's the guy. Or John. Or whatever the fuck you want to call me. It's Friday. I'm having a beer. And I found a little something at Walmart, Walgreens today. Um, it's slightly opened. Because I think they... I've seen these things at Walmart before. This is a Spider-Man mystery box. I've seen these things at Walmart before. Regular Walmart. Not Walgreens, but regular Walmart. But I've never seen these ones. I've seen other Marvel ones. But uh, usually they have a little strip across, across here that shows the items that are in it. So I'm thinking Walgreens wanted to make this an official... Um, official mystery box and they ripped this open to take the thing out so let's open it up it's going to be easy to open since it's already been pretty much so there's five items forgive me five items in this spider-man box it doesn't say anywhere on what's on it, in it. So let's go ahead and open it. So, but first, oh, come to daddy. So let's go ahead and open it. Okay. Not bad of a box. I mean, it could be better. Uh, I mean, I was expecting a Maybe a Funko Pop. But, uh, let's get into it. Um, first thing, there's a patch. Spider-Man patch. It says, of course, it just says, it's an iron-on patch. And, of course, it just says Spider-Man. Um, weird to see, um, socks. Yeah. Plain old Spider-Man socks. I just wanted to make this quick video. I mean, usually I do a GameStop one, but with there not being Black Friday this year, I'm trying to scramble around and find what mystery boxes I can find. Um, there'll be a video before this that's another mystery box. So go ahead and check that out. Uh, let's. That's two items. Uh, let's go with this item. Oh, shit. Fuck. Um, it's a challenge coin with display stand. Yeah. And I have to mention, I paid 20 bucks for this thing. And yet, I get a, the box is damaged. Yeah, the box is dented, and the patch is bent. This thing don't even sit right. The whole thing is, like, dented in. Um, there's a... Oh, nice. Even, even this thing is not even on there correctly. Uh, this is a plush throw blanket. Let's go ahead and open it up. Yeah. Yeah, let's put adhesive, adhesive on a flush, flush blanket. That's amazing. Might have to stand up to show this. It actually looks pretty cool. I mean... Let me get behind it. That is actually pretty cool. Can you guys see that? I'm not sure if you can because I'm behind it. But it says, uh... Daily Bugle, uh, 
friendly neighborhood Spider-Man. And then it has the picture of Spider-Man. That is actually pretty cool. I don't know if I'll ever use it, but it seems pretty cool. It's pretty thin. So yeah, we'll toss that on top of my Star Wars blanket. There's one more thing in this box. It's that. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. It's not that. It's a print. Not the best. It's pretty much printed on cardboard. It's a cardboard print. So for 20 bucks you get five items. A print, a pair of socks, a fleece blanket, a patch, and a coin. I mean, I've spent worse money on things, but uh, this takes the cake. It's not really worth the 20 bucks that you pay for it. I mean, I'm definitely going to wear these socks. Let's, let's, let's go ahead and take the socks out of the packaging. Let's see what kind of socks they are. Uh, yeah, I'd, I'd wear these around the house probably. I mean, they look pretty cool. There's there's the back. There's the front. You got Spider-Man's head on them. And then you got the city skyline on the bottom that says uh protect yeah, protector of New York, which you can't even really make out because they put it in a horrible place. It wraps around. They're kind of like tube socks. I mean, they have stretch. So yeah, I definitely wear these. I frame that print. I mean, I already I got a Spider-Man poster on my wall. So when I saw this box, I was like, "Kick ass!" I love Spider-Man. Uh. The patch, uh, it's cool. If I had a jean jacket or a trench coat or a leather jacket, I'd put this on it. I mean, it'd be cool, I mean. But out of all of it, the socks and the fleece blanket are the best. I mean, shit. But, uh... I thought I'd quickly open this. Saw it at Walgreens when I was there. So I picked it up. Um, yeah. Uh, check out the video before this. The mystery box before this. I'll probably see if I can find some more mystery boxes. And yeah, open up some more. So take it easy, guys.